EA Sports. It's in the game. Calls for the fair catch. And they make the fair catch around the 45-yard line. And what a game it's been for this quarterback, Kirk. Well, I think the great thing that he's been able to do is spread the football around. It's not just been one receiver. And when you can find more receivers, it makes it much easier to move the ball down the field. And he's shown it earlier on that touchdown. But this guy can also hurt you with his feet. So he's a guy you have to be aware of, not just with his ability to throw the ball, but also be aware of his athletic ability. Really no surprises in this game. He's played well. His teammates have played well. And they're in the driver's seat. This receiver's been having himself a great game. Well, Brad, he really has, and he's got the hot hand. And let's give some credit to the offensive coordinator because he's smart enough to get the football to him and allow him to make these plays that's helping this offense out. And now with these two scores, you've got to think that this defense is going to try to do something to slow him down. If this defense doesn't find a way to slow this guy down, they're not going to have much of a chance to win this game. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. We've seen some mistakes from this quarterback tonight, Kirk. Right now, the defensive pressure flat out is causing these turnovers. When you're a defensive coordinator, you want to always try to get your defense to pin their ears back and put pressure on the quarterback. When you do that, you're going to create opportunities. For Alabama, it's a case of the defense doing a great job of capitalizing on the quarterback's mistakes. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. We're taking a look at a seasoned defender logging another huge effort. Yeah, I think we're all beginning to see that this guy seems to play much faster in person than when you watch him on TV or when you study him on tape. Yeah, and with three sacks, you might want to start chipping this guy. You know, you better use a running back, you better use a tight end, anything you can this long down. You know he relishes the chance to get the better of these guys. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. For Auburn, they've had the wind taken out of their sails in the first half, and they've got some work to do. Here's more from Aaron Andrews. Well, it was a quiet team walking into the locker room. They seemed to be in absolute shock at what had transpired thus far. When I tried to ask their head coach for a statement, he ran past and said no comment. Brad? 